first I head up the design studio, uh, the Gavitas studio in London. We have designed the range of haven seating, tabling and screening for Alamur. The essence of the project is an exploration of the relationship between furniture and human behaviour and to what extent we as designers are able to influence that behaviour. Uh, we are necessarily concerned with what we would call the psychology of space and our desire to facilitate, allow and encourage different types of behaviour uh, in, dif in different environments. So, the range consists of um, four key elements. We have a benching, a series of benching units, we have a series of modular sofa systems, sofa systems and armchairs that can come with or without headrests. And there is um, a series of screen units which use um, three-dimensionally knitted um, technology. And there is a series of tables. Now, all of these units can be combined in different ways to create different mini environments. So, um, for example, we go, we go over here and we have um, what one would call the most private space you might, that you might want to create, that, for example, would be in an airport. Um, and this creates your own little private world. Uh, the acoustics are perfect and you get, obviously, a, a wonderful sense of privacy um, and, and isolation. And then you can sort of move on to um, here what one might call almost a nesting unit um, when you have two sofas facing each other and this becomes um, the marvellous little mini meeting room within the larger space. And this acts as a lovely little informal space where you can chat and have a, have a meeting without you feeling as though it's a great big boardroom conference. Um, and yet I think the relaxed nature of the environment helps to make for a more relaxed form of meeting. Um, I think that same concept it, it extends to one little point that we try to include in the design which um, is that, for example, the, the height of this headrest when combined with the sofa um, is such that it allows people to, to lean on this in a relaxed manner and join a conversation, um, much in the same way as we thought from just observing um, human behavior that, that people talk over a garden fence. And I think it's interesting that uh, often people feel more at ease talking when they have some form of barrier in between them than they do when there's, when there's nothing. Um, so, there we go, a few points on Haven. Thank you very much and enjoy.